All right, so again, we're working on the side view of the female form. We are working on page 19 in your books. Make sure you get your pencil and eraser out, okay? So the first form that we're going to make is the side profile of the head. We're gonna give, give it that motorcycle helmet shape to start with. Okay, so that's going to be the first thing that we're making. We're gonna pull the horizontal line here that we have here across. This is gonna be the demarcation line at the middle of the head for our person here, okay? Again, this is a placeholder for what we're doing here. And we're going to draw a curved line from uh, box one. Okay. Spine down to box four. Okay. I'm using a searching line to kind of describe a really weird <laughs> curving spine. Okay, this is the same line here that we do from the top of box one down to the bottom of box four. This is going to help us with our figure, okay? And using the same line that we have from box two and the bottom of box three, that's going to be A, where our neck ends, okay? Shoulders begin and rib cage curving down and ending here, okay? Rib cage, neck, shoulder. We're gonna go down to box four. And we're gonna just put in place hips and stuff here, too, as well. All right. We're going to extend from the hips in the bo bottom of box four down to the bottom of six. Knee caps, right? Rolling down to eight. Ankles. Foot. Okay. Notice how we have this line going all the way kind of down here. On in box three near the bottom, we're gonna put our elbow coming from the shoulder down, down to the hand, fingers, okay. So this is our basic kind of artsy skeleton where we're gonna build our musculature on top of. Musculature and fat and all, of the, all the other elements that make a human form. Okay. So, how are we doing guys?
So as we start to add on the physical features of the human body here, we're going to keep in mind that we're trying to adhere to that skeleton and that also kind of the flow of the body too as well. You can almost fill in the blanks, right? Does that make sense? You can, you can see that where we're gonna be putting certain um, physical attributes and components of the body, of the human body, automatically. Just because you guys have looking at, been looking at human bodies your entire life, you kind of know where certain things are. And if they're not proportionally right, there's this thing called the uncanny valley, where you see something that resembles a human, but doesn't quite look like a human, and it's disturbing to look at. You're, we as humans, like other animals, when we see something that's close to what we are, but not, it's disturbing, right? So what we're gonna do first, we're gonna start up here, we're gonna add, you know, the muscles, tendons, and shapes that we're used to. I'm gonna add some muscles here, over here, coming down. We have the shoulder muscles, right? Shoulder muscles, neck muscles, all those things that kind of make up us humans. Back muscles too as well, coming down. Shoulder, right? Bicep tricep, back of the back of the arm, elbow, right, forearm, wrist, right. breast or bust. Okay. Notice these aren't like gigantic mounds, okay? Gravity, man, guys, gravity. Muscles, abdomen, coming down. Here, same. same level. Hip flexors, obliques, hip flexors, butt. A little curve of the lower back right there that we see. Okay. Come down here where the hand is. Where's our thumb end? Okay, right around there. We know that. That kind of folds in. That folds in. His fingers are folding in. Boom. Okay. Quadricep. Tucking in. Kneecap. Hamstring. Back of the knee. Calf. Ankle. Heel. See where I'm going with this? Yeah. or front of calf, front of foot, or top of the foot, arch, heel, ankle, ball of the foot, little toe, big toe over here. That's the basic structure that we're looking for, guys. Now, now that we have kind of like our kind of generic canon female form, we can dress it however we want. We can add facial features, etc. Again, we've gone over facial proportions already. You can do that real fast. Eyes, 
are one width of an eye apart, meaning that the distance between these two eyes is the width of one eye. And I'm gonna do just a really quick job of adding some facial features here. Not spend a lot of detail on it. Just hints. Nose, nose bridge, eyebrows, lips. Okay. Simple, simple, simple. Give her more of a defined chin and jawline. That shape, again, is just a placeholder, right? Alicia Kruger. Hello. You're late. You're driving. Cosima, you're a bad influence. I did you a favor, Cosima, and this is how you repay me. Who's in the back seat? Is that is that Randazzo? And that's Ananda. That's wonderful. No, it's not. It's terrible. What the hell? Bring me back a sticker. All right, listen to me. Listen to me, Alicia. Now listen to me carefully. Don't talk. Don't talk. Okay? Go to my YouTube channel, watch the videos, and do the assignment. Turn it in to me later, okay? Do you understand? You have boogers. I can... Yep. What? I... Did I tell you to talk? Did I say you could talk now? No, I did not. No, I did not. Shh, quiet. That hat's way too big for your face. Anyways. Drive safely. Do the work over the weekend. And I'll see you on Monday. Oh, I'll see you on Tuesday. Or actually, I'll see you on Wednesday. Shut up, Kasima. Have a great weekend. Please be safe. Don't be stupid. Do you understand? Good God. Okay, kids, don't be like a... Oh, Lord. Okay, now, going back to the drawing. Shh, turn your mic off. Okay, going back to the drawing, guys. We're going to add a little hairline here. We're going to give her kind of a, a cool pixie look. Yeah, see that? Don't be like Alicia, guys. Don't go to Tahoe. Wait, Ava, are you going to Tahoe? That sucks for to be you. Man, doesn't it just suck to have an older sister who can do stuff? I'm so sorry. Did she even invite you? No. Wow, that's cold. Oh, well, she had the same experience with, you know, Annalise, so. Honestly, Annalise put a really funny video of your sister Alicia having a meltdown online. It was pretty funny. Yeah, her having a, a tantrum. So, you know, say love you. Anyways, so we can add hair. I'm gonna go over here and I'm going, we didn't do profiles yet. We're gonna come back to facial proportions and do profiles later. But I'm just gonna do a really simple face and flush this out. You know, kids, COVID's real. It's out there. Please be safe. Okay? Just saying. If you're gonna go someplace, stay within your pod, y'all. So I'm just gonna add some hair here and chunk things out. Do do do. Just got like kind of a pixie cut. Jim, 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 Right? Fun stuff. Okay. 
And then you just, we'll just lightly erase that so it doesn't look too weird. So. All right, anyways. Now you can dress your, your person however way you want. I'm going to, I don't know what I'm gonna do with this. Uh, let's do, what do you guys think? Should I make her a, a superhero or something? What do you think? Yeah, no? Soccer player? Soccer player? No. Davi, okay. Smile child. There you go. I'm gonna make her a surfer. She's gonna be wearing a wetsuit. How about that? So, tight on the neck. I'm gonna make sure that my levels are the same here. Doom, 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 doom. doom. So, long sleeve, wetsuit, coming down here. No booties, no gloves, no hood. We're going to make it a chest zip. So, we got this coming over here. And most of the chest zips now are asymmetrical. Right like that. Some elbow pads, maybe. Now I'm going to show more elbow pad on this side than the front, right? So she has a chest zip configuration here. That's kind of cool. We'll give her some large knee pad section here. So look at that. All right. sure it lines up All right okay Ta -da. what's it's actually pretty easy to draw and we'll make some kind of cool details like maybe there's like some stripes coming down and that's going to look a lot like this wait wait, wait. that's too low oh my goodness Russell Run it up. Should be up here and coming down. There we go. Go. And there you have it, guys. Surfer chic. And then maybe these are darker. Yeah, we'll make these stripes darker. Maybe it's a light gray wetsuit. You know, sticking with the color scheme of. Carmel High. All right. And then maybe the chest zip panel is darker than the rest of the wetsuit. Yeah. Cool. All right. Ta da. Ooh, maybe we'll do like a, a shoulder patch of some sort on both sides. I do like a do you know? Boom. So we're gonna continue working on these kinds of drawings uh, later on in during the semester.